the, there is a, a, a blonde, a, a blondie running from the house. Where where is that? I have never heard that before, honey. Video of someone running away from the house at 2 a.m. They wouldn't have no reason to run away from the house because at 2 a.m. Sana and, and Sana, you could tell in this video, Sana and Ethan was still at their food truck and Kaylee and Maddie left by 158. They left the food truck by 158, but but the PCA said that they, that Dylan said Dylan said that they got to the house on 140 something. When at 140 something, they were still in the food truck waiting for their food. It's right here on the video, and the original video had timestamp or everything. I already seen that. They delete that video, the long ass video footage that they had in YouTube from this video with timestamps and everything. They delete that shit. I wonder yourself why they delete that shit. It have Kaylee and Maddie leaving the, the food truck and leaving behind John Jack Show Walter around 158. Ethan and Santa left around 207, 208. They left the food truck. So by two o'clock, it's impossible that anyone, either Kaylee, Maddie, Ethan, Santa, they were not at the home at that time. And they said that they got there at 140 something. No one was there at 140 something. Nobody but Bethany and Dylan. And that's confirmed with this video. I seen the, the original footage. So I, I don't know uh, where you have seen like a video at 2 a.m. Somebody running out the house and da 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 da. Because at 2 p.m. nothing was going on. Y'all could tell at 2 p.m. was nothing going on because phone calls for Jack Decor is still happening around 3 o'clock until 2, 3.30 in the morning. So it was nothing going on in the house. I don't know from where y'all get video of someone running out the house at 2 o'clock because none of that shit is real. And if you heard it from someone, just act like you didn't hear nothing because they just playing you the fuck out. I heard that one the who if Bethany or Dylan, she's kind of blondy too. Yeah, but here's the thing. Like, it's no reality on that whatever video of uh, no one running away from the house. Even that video of the guys that got stopped at the yard over there underneath the, 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 the house, is re you really can't see no one from, from that far. The house is not that close. I don't know from where y'all got that from. I wonder where video say gave cop, but I wonder where video say gave to cops. I don't know. Y'all lose. Yeah, y'all lost me. Is there a blondie guy named James related to Bethany of anyone? No, that I know of. But again, don't don't waste don't waste your time like thinking about whatever you're talking about right now because I'm going to tell you right now, it's just nothing there. It's just like the Linda Lane footage. People take waste their time on the Linda Lane footage when it's nothing there. It's nothing that it has to do. It's confirmed that it was a domestic dispute. They were using that footage on a domestic dispute that's around the same time early that day. It's confirmed already that that footage, the only reason it's out there, it, it was because it was a domestic violence call and that video was used as evidence. It doesn't have nothing to do with the Idaho 4 case and these people are idiots. Like they don't know what they're talking about. That should never have charged BK too many holes. And it, yeah, too many holes and it's not no probable cause. Like it's not listen, if they were they were looking at Cole Burger like for a week, 
don't you think that they would they would make him come through to the to the police station and get a statement from him get a dna swab and if he didn't comply they would go to the judge and look for for a dna swab warrant but no they let him linger for a whole month around the area and then whenever he left back to home to go home then now oh yeah he's running away He's running away. We need to go and get him because we got this and this and this and that. When you don't have not a fucking thing. You didn't have no DNA to confirm it was him. It, whatever low tech shit that you have, it can't even be confirmed it was him. Now, no cell phone ping, no, no, nothing. You're going to have to have Dylan Mortensen, Dylan Mortensen saying, yeah, that was Brian Kohlberger. And she can't even prove that shit. Because you said she, he had a mask on his face. You said he was like five foot six when the guy is almost six foot two. Who the fuck you talking to? Oh my God, dude. Ah, is it Cody Bundy, right? Please stop talking about it. Y'all giving me headache right now. Y'all really giving me headache with nothing. I tried to put something together in my head before I share. Okay, so please make sure you investigate with before you share it. Cause what y'all sharing right now about that camera, whatever y'all talking about, a blondie running away from this house at two o'clock in the morning. I'm trying to tell ya, the girls left the food truck at 158. I hope y'all listening, ladies. The girls left the food truck at 158 in the morning. Ethan and Santa left the food truck at 208. So for y'all to say that someone was running out the house at two o'clock in the morning was caught for whatever camera and stuff. Y'all telling me that the killing started at two o'clock in the morning and somebody ran out the house that it was blunt because it was killing going on when the girls were not even at the house. When Ethan and Santa weren't even at the house yet. Again, y'all going by because at 1.40.45, Natterick. They were not at the home at 145 because in the footage is Maddie and Kaylee at 158 leaving the food truck. This is how bad of a liar they are. Please don't let them play you out. Don't get yourself wrapped up on an ad rip that it doesn't exist. Please. I already got headache with the ad rip of the content creators. Like if I have like my own community thinking like these bullshitted ass content creators i'm gonna ha i'm gonna have to fucking go i'm gonna have to fucking go because i cannot stand like i cannot stand the narrative that y'all talking about right now with no kind of investigation with no kind of proof again if y'all knew no better y'all knew that this video right here the girls left the house on 158 so it's impossible that they would have got there in two minutes it's impossible that they would start getting killed at 2 o'clock in the morning when, when they steal phone calls from their phone going out at 3 o'clock in the morning. Come on, please, girls. Can we make sense? Can we, before y'all share anything on the chat room, can y'all make sure that y'all know what y'all talking about and it's investigated with timeline and everything due to the public information provided? Because y'all going to end up doing the same shit that we talking about. He, the same shit that we talking against is the same shit that y'all doing right now with this video at 2 o'clock in the morning. Someone running out the house that is blonde and shit. I know, Amy, that you don't mean no harm. But at the same time, investigate your shit way before you even talking about it. Bernice, please don't share shit if you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Don't go by Nada Riffs. Don't do that. This is the same shit that we dogging people about. And now we're going to do it here on our channel too. On the chat room. I don't want to start. I don't want to start blocking people left and right. I'm telling you right now. I, I love you. I appreciate you. But if y'all going to start doing the same shit that other people do. Inventing shit in the head that don't make sense. Because if y'all what y'all talking about right now makes any sense. I will tell you right now. 
because I don't have nothing against you and I love you. But at the same time, I cannot have my own ladies here in this chat room talking a whole bunch of poop when it don't make no sense. Y'all could do that over there with Michelle Lee, though. 